is Al Hakam, the one who decides, the one who creates the causes of things happening in the whole of universe. Hakam comes from the word hukum, and hukum is related to the word hikma. Hikma in Arabic usually is translated in lighter fashion as wisdom or inner meaning. But in reality, hikma means the creation of a cause and to lead this cause through conditions which is created by the same source who created the cause all the way to its effect. <coughs> So, we know that in everything which we do, and we also should know that we are unable to do, so therefore instead of saying everything which we do, we should say everything which is done through us. And everything which happens, is decided only by one and only, as he says himself, Allah Ta'ala alone. He is the one who creates the sabab. Sabab is the cause. But then every sabab has a musabib, which means the one who creates the cause. And then there is Musabibi Hakiki, the true and only cause, <coughs> which is Al Hakam, the one who creates all and everything which happens. Allah Ta'ala says again in the Quran al Karim that whether we will revolt against Him, or whether we will believe in him and we will obey him in our mother's bellies, in the mother's womb. And at the same time, again, he says in the Quran al karim that men will not have anything unless he strives for it himself. Now, there appears to be a contradiction there, Astaghfirullah, and some people who are cynics, they find out all sorts of contradictions, not only in the Quran al karim but also in the Hadith. They even find opposites in the Asma al -Husna. But they are not opposites, they are complementary. They more or less enforce each other. Like night and day are not opposite each other, but night is necessary to see the day, and the day is necessary to see the night. One day, Hazrat Ali Kerem Allah was passing under a wall which was bent like this and all cracked, cracked and just about to fall any minute and as he was passing under it he ran under it to the other side where the wall was straight and precisely a cynic said Ya Ali don't you believe in destiny and the response of Hazrat Ali was, No, I do believe in destiny, except I take refuge in destiny from destiny. 
Indeed, what happened to my son, your brother Habib, was his destiny. We come to this world without asking to come to this world, and we will leave this world without asking nor wanting to leave this world when he decides. But those are the extremes. But everything which happens to us and everything which happens through us is destined. But not only us, but from the galaxies to the smallest atom, there is the control and that there is a cause which creates the effect and the causer of the cause is Al-Hakam, the one who is the only decider. Where is our position in this situation? I think the attitude of Azrit Ali, Karamallahu Wachahu, shows us the attitude. Because indeed there is a destiny, a cause is created to end up in an effect. But this cause has to run through certain conditions. And these conditions should be available to reach to this effect. There is also, amongst these conditions, there is also the time when this cause is going to cause this effect to take place. When was our friend Habib to die, in short? And what conditions there has to be for him to die? Now the conditions themselves, in a sense, is also created by other causes with the same maker of causes. And again, Allah Ta'ala says that when your time comes, it will not be delayed by an hour. So the time is also fixed. Then what does Hazrat Ali Keramallahu Vachahu means by saying I take refuge in destiny from destiny? We certainly are not able to create causes. But I think if we understand the causes, if we understand the conditions, we may not be able to change it, but we will be together instead of in opposition to what is happening, but we will be a part of what is happening. Do you understand what I am saying? To make it clear, when you worry now our brother Salih has been taken ill and has been taken to the emergency ward. Now we worry, don't we? Okay. When we worry, we are not inside the conditions. We are outside of the conditions. While if we were inside the conditions, we wouldn't work.